As I am uploading this video today, August 13, 2018, it has been nine years since my dad passed away. Seeing as it is not an easy thing to handle, I ask for support and love towards this video. I hope you guys enjoy. So hi daddy, I will always miss you. Your daughter will always love and make you proud. Alrighty, good morning guys. It is Tuesday, June, no July, sorry. 24th and this morning we woke up we went to go eat some tacos yay then afterwards we went to go buy my dad some flowers and right now we are on our way to his grave unfortunately he is buried here so the few times that we can actually come see him is when we come to Mexico so every year that we come to Mexico is like our favorite part to come and visit him so right now this is the Pantheon, the cemetery, and right now we're walking. All of these are different people buried here. They all have their different backstories. But right now we are on our way to visit my dad. I kind of show you guys all these different people, tombs that are being built. And when we get to my dad's, which we're almost there, his is very different from everyone else's. We basically built him like a little house type thing. It's not an actual like tombstone or anything like that. It's very, very different. Um, so we're here and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. So this is very something very dear to me and me showing you guys this, it's gonna, hopefully you guys like it, okay? This is his chapel right here. It's basically like a little house type thing. And then he has all of this. Look at the top. It's, it was made specifically for him. The inside is beautiful. The outside is beautiful. But compared to everyone else's, I think my dad's is the most gorgeous thing ever. When we came to marry him um, back in August of 2009, I was very young, you know. But I do remember us all coming here and burying him and this wasn't built until after so first he was buried and then he, this was built because he's obviously underground and so he has this whole thing right now they have not taken good care of it which i'm really a little bit annoyed right now because it's supposed to be nicely cut he has a nice little arch right here of trees and then the cross obviously and so those are the flowers that we're about to bring into him. That one right there, and then that one right there. We got him two flowers. You always get him two or three flowers each year. Alrighty guys, so this is the inside of my dad's chapel. This is my dad right here. This is just like a little thing that we have. He was born the 15th of May, 1978. And then he died um, the 13th of August of 2009. So just like the thing, we have the transit over here, and then so we have the some over here. And this is his copy of right here, it is beautiful. And these are the fresh flowers, these two are the flowers that we just got him. And these have been here for a while. And he is down there. Um, we don't usually go down there, only on special occasions. But, and then this is the top part of it. Like the Vicencita. It's so beautiful in here, I love it so much. And so we're just gonna hang out here for a little bit and I'll put some video footage of all that we do in here.
cuando eras pequeña. Gracias papá por quererme, por cuidarme y protegerme. Nunca dejes de anularme y en momentos brazos fuertes. Y aunque mujer me convierta, quiero ser tu niña siempre. Toma mi mano con fuerza, no me sueltes, te lo ruego. Caminemos siempre juntos, que a donde vaya te llevo. Y no importa que pase ni pase los años entre tú y yo, la sangre es la misma. So we are leaving the cemetery now. Um, we said our goodbyes. We did a little bit of singing. So we are leaving. And we'll see what we do later. 